What's going on guys? I'm on a no cooling call here. The inside is running up in the apartment, so the fan inside is running. So that's good. You want to make sure that's running. This is our troubled unit here where the complaint was. As you can see, the fan is running, but I don't hear the compressor. The compressor is down in here. So the fan's good, but no compressor. So probably going to have a back capacitor. That's about the most common. Go ahead and pull the power for you new guys. That turns the power off. We'll take the cover off and see what's going on. This is about the most common problems with a lot of air conditioners. Bad capacitor. Oh, whoever was here before didn't put a screw in over there. So, yeah, this is the original capacitor that comes with the the AC unit. So we'll test it. Let's do a little discharge first. Got my rubber handle here, just getting the power out of that capacitor. We're gonna test it with our meter. Now, if you don't have a meter, you're just gonna be guessing. So, I recommend a meter, especially if you're a technician, but if you're a homeowner and you wanna take a chance, Go ahead. I always leave links to capacitors as well in the in the video description below. So if you need you a capacitor, you can buy it through the link below and have it delivered to your house. They range in price. It could be from 20 bucks to 50 bucks. All right, I'm gonna pull the meter out and test this capacitor. Okay, I'm gonna set my meter to cap. Most meters have MFD for microfarads, but mine has cap. So you, that's what you're testing on these capacitors is the microfarads. So one to common and one to the herm. One point five zero. That is not good. I'm, I think this is a 40 slash 5 capacitor. So yeah, you'll see uh, there's a C here for common, Herm over here for, for the compressor, and the fan here. So that's how you know which ones to, turn, to touch. If you want to test the fan, microfarads, common to fan. And it should say 5 or whatever the capacitor calls for. So I'm going to pull this out and we'll take a closer look. All right, this is the old one that I pulled out. As you can see, it's a 40 slash 5. So you want the Herm, common to Herm to be 40, common to fan to be 5. It says it right there. So we'll get our new 40. And we'll put it into the plumbing strap and wire it back down. All right, the new capacitor is in. And this is a Goodman air conditioner. So the wiring is usually the same. If you have any other different brand than a Goodman the wiring might be a little different the colors that is but capacitors are usually uh, universal on these things they'll just be different color wires on the Goodman AC here yellow for Herm brown for fan and purple to common and red to common as well all right let's try it out I'm on call this is a Sunday Sunday after hours emergency call so come on big money no whammy oh yeah you can hear that compressor start up sounding good yeah bad cap is all it was again I'll leave links to these in the description below if you need a new capacitor just click on the description below and make sure your microfarads match your unit don't put a, a 30 on it on your unit if it needs a 40 you can always go up a little bit, but never down. So make sure you match the uh, microfarads for your unit, for you homeowners that watch and want to take a shot with a new capacitor. And uh, that's not it. I get a lot of uh, questions like, hey Lex, what if it's not the capacitor? It could be low on refrigerant, meaning you'll need to get a technician out to fill it up for you and find the leak, or it could be the float switch. Those are the top three easy, simple fixes for these air conditioners. If the float switch pan is full underneath your air handler up inside, the air handler is inside. If, the, if it's full of water, you'll see a little round switch or a little clip in the pan. Just pull that up and you got to clear the line out. 
So the refrigerant on this thing is good. It's a uh, TXV and it's hunting around 12 sub cool. And that superheat's gonna come down, man. It's 86 degrees in that apartment on this scorching 96 degree Florida day. So that's fine. All right, guys, I hope this helps. I hope this brings value to you and I'll see you in the next one. Late. Jungle